In a quaint village nestled between rolling hills and babbling brooks, there lived a curious inventor named Elias. He was renowned throughout the land for his ingenious creations and the warm heart that beat. Beneath his tinkering fingers, with eyes that sparkled with a desire to make the world a better place. Elias spent his days crafting gadgets that would alleviate the struggles of his fellow villagers. One chilly morning, as the mist clung to the trees, Elias had an idea that stirred his spirit like never before. He set to work on his latest project, a device that could capture and amplify acts of kindness. As he toiled away in his workshop, his heart swelled with anticipation, imagining the positive impact his invention could have on the world. Weeks turned into months, and finally, Elias held in his hands the kindness code, a small, intricate device imbued with a touch of magic. It was designed to detect even the smallest acts of kindness and amplify them, spreading the warmth and goodwill far and wide. Armed with his creation, Elias embarked on a mission to encourage kindness among his villagers. He began with simple gestures, holding doors, sharing smiles, and helping the elderly. The kindness code responded with a soft glow, its magic fueling the positive energy. Word spread quickly, and soon the villagers were inspired to outdo one another in acts of kindness. Friends helped friends. Neighbors reached out to those in need. And even the grumpiest of villages softened their hearts. The village blossomed into a haven of compassion. And Elias reveled in the transformation he had set in motion. He watched as the simple acts of kindness he had nurtured grew into an unbreakable bond among the villagers. The once distanced villagers now gathered in the village square sharing stories of the impact of their actions and the joy it brought them. However, not everyone was pleased with this newfound spirit of kindness. A shadowy figure named Malachi emerged from the outskirts of the village. He was envious of the villagers' unity and believed that kindness was a sign of weakness. Malachi harbored the deep-seated bitterness. Having felt rejected by the community years ago, Determined to disrupt the harmony, Malachi devised a plan to steal the kindness code. Under the cover of night, he sneaked into Elias's workshop and seized the device. He thought that by removing the source of kindness, he could turn the villagers against each other once more. As the days passed without the kindness code, the villagers felt a subtle change in their spirits. They started to bicker over trivial matters and smiles gave way to frowns. Elias noticed this shift and knew he had to act swiftly. He tracked down Malachi and confronted him. His eyes filled with a mixture of sadness and understanding. Elias pleaded with Malachi, sharing his own story of once feeling alone and isolated. He spoke of the power of kindness and how it had the potential to heal wounds and bridge gaps. Malachi hesitated. The memories of his own pain warring with his desire for vengeance. Slowly, his heart softened, and he returned the kindness code to Elias. With the device back in his possession, Elias rekindled the village's kindness, reminding them of the unity they had shared. Malachi, humbled by Elias's compassion, decided to change his ways. He began by offering a sincere apology to the villagers. And over time, he too became an integral part of the community. The village flourished once more, stronger than before, with kindness radiating from every corner. The kindness code continued to amplify the village's goodwill, its magic extending beyond the village borders and touching the hearts of neighboring communities. And so, the legacy of Elias's invention lived on. A testament to the power of a single act of kindness to transform lives and mend the deepest of wounds. The kindness code reminded everyone that kindness wasn't a sign of weakness, but a beacon of strength that had the potential to heal even the most broken of souls.